Yeah, hello. Hello and welcome. Uh, my name is Raj. So I'm currently here to uh, express my views and, of course, to show how what is WorldBrain and what is in it. So uh, of course, in uh, today's world, uh, data, which is our most important thing for us, and data is money, right? So if you have data, we can port it to several things. We can make it several things, and we can advertise, prioritize, and make other things. So if you have data, we have money. So what we are doing at uh, WorldBrain, basically this is an organization. Uh, like it is a starting organization. And uh, WorldBrain basically uh, is an extension that imports your data, basically. Uh, and it is uh, the extension that has personal control of your knowledge, your search history. What it does is uh, it is basically a, a Chrome extension. When you search things on the web browser, on your uh, social media uh, websites, or on the Google, you can import your complete history to your local uh, database. And from there, you can do other things. Like you can uh, search other uh, organizations like, uh, and even uh, on the social media, as I mentioned earlier, you can. Uh, have the control of your complete data and do your search on the on that data which is stro stored in your local uh, database. So this will manually uh, we have uh, ported our things on the Chrome that you can make links over there in the database and you can just share it to the others. So you can voluntarily have your followers, or basically it is uh, useful for the researchers, people who are collaborating with the other uh, resources, and of course the scientists. Suppose I am searching for the data that is I think is more genuine, and my partner somewhere else in the world is searching for other things. So I can uh, hopefully recommend him that I have searched uh, the genuine things I have, and I can recommend him through our like links or are there so I can recommend him the whole thing so that he is not going to waste uh, more time on the searching data that uh, other things and he is going to uh, get the things more easier so yes you can have uh, do things on like you can share it uh, with the others annotate it uh, bookmark it and like in comments so we are uh, basically working on the browser APIs and expose data in interoperable formats. And of course, you are having your full control over the data. You are not going to, uh, it is not being shared to other third party people like others do. And you can uh, have your full control, as I mentioned, and you can share when you're, whenever you want, means whoever you want. Suppose your friend is doing the same thing and you want to help him with the things that you have searched, that you have managed to collect in your local uh, history. You can directly uh, give the links, and uh, you can uh, collaborate it. So just imagine like what you can do with the data. You can make your visualizations. You can make your predictions. You can make your other things that can collaborate into the science and research, of course. So WorldBrain's use case is basically the bubble search. and. You can like the groups you follow. Suppose uh, I am here and I'm researching on some neuroscience or something else. I can follow other groups who are working on that and can get the easier data and genuine data over there. So you can recommend. And of course, for example, if you have more working experience, you can go to worldbrand.io and Vision. So of course, uh, we are new community, and we uh, hopefully applied this year to the uh, Google Summer of Code as an organization. And we uh, got selected in Google Summer of Code. And currently, we have like 6,000 users of it. And uh, we hope that, actually, uh, mo uh, we are uh, hoping that more contributors could come to our organizations and uh, work as mentors uh, as well. I am the one of the mentors at uh, WorldBrain. And I hope uh, many of contributors could come. And of course, we are porting and have features to implement that we are porting this to uh, Android support, iOS support, and other like uh, Firefox extensions as well. So I welcome all the developers over there. Maybe they can apply as a student uh, for the Google Summer of Course 2017. 
and i hope yeah thank you very much for your time thank you